All right, what's up, guys? I'm Bryce. I'm Rob. And I'm Zoff. And we are Real Time. Today, we got book two, episodes 15 and 16 of Avatar The Last Airbender. This is Tales of Ba Sing Se and Appa's Lost Days. Obviously, right now, we are in Ba Sing Se, and everything is not what it seems, as they say. Pretty much, ever since we got here, it was weird. Um, we have this tour guide, had this tour guide, actually. She like was just smiling the whole time kind of downplaying what was going on and like their questions about meeting the king she's like you'll meet him in a week and then they snuck into a party met some people but like they tried talking about this issue like they have a real issue that you know they can stop they have information to stop the fire nation they know when the the uh eclipse is but the guy was pretty much saying like we don't talk about that war here like we're in we live in a utopia we don't tell our people that there's a war going on so you can't tell them that and pretty much we're not going to take you guys seriously that's just crazy behavior everyone knows there's a war going on besides i guess these people but it's a very serious thing and it's going to get a lot worse especially if people are not ready and they attack so like i don't know what they're thinking um hopefully we can change their ways though because this is not what I thought Bossing Say would be like. Yeah, that Bossing Say episode was weird. It it gave me the creeps, but the first episode, the drill was much better. I liked the fight between Aang and uh, Azula. I mean, Azula sort of took him out, and made ease with the Avatar, but they did su successfully stop the drill from it was it did penetrate the wall, but they. Uh, they got it to not go the whole way in, so <laughs> that sounds really crazy, but that's what happened. And I feel like after doing that, just like saving a busting city's wall, they would give them a time of day to talk to the king, at least try to. I mean, <laughs> there is people trying to go through your wall right now, and they won't let them talk about war. And yeah, that led to bad things, especially for Jet. Yeah, Jet has been back for like the past couple episodes. He's been hanging around Zuko and Iroh. Uh, at first, as allies, they, they stole some food together. They were hanging out all on good terms. But then Jet figured it out, figured out they are firebenders. And that's that's when everything changed. Pretty much Jet just like made it his mission to, to bust these guys. He really wants them to get caught. But he ended up just making himself look like the bad guy in the process um and he was captured by like the guards of bossing say or whatever taken underground it looked like and they were doing some weird like hypnotizing like mental torture stuff like it was really strange but we are getting like pretty far into into book two and i'm i'm very excited for a lot of these upcoming episodes i know they're gonna be a lot of, a lot of fun very good and I'm just very, very excited to keep watching. And we need Appa. All right, guys, that's pretty much it, though. Before we get into this episode, if you guys have been enjoying our Avatar The Last Airbender reactions, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Check out our links in the description. We got our Patreon, our Discord, our second channel, ATOC, all of our social medias, and the address to our P.O. Box. But yeah, let's get into it. Book 2, Episodes 15 and 16 of Avatar The Last Airbender, Tales of Ba Sing Se, and Appa's Lost Days. Let's go. Whoa. The Tale of Tof Toph and Katara. Oh, okay. <laughs> First person we see is Aang. He's shaving. <laughs> what is the that? Hell? Sokka. He had a mustache. <gasps> Toph, aren't you gonna get ready for the day? <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm ready. You're not gonna wash up. Just brushes the dirt off of her. You know what we need? A girl's day out. I have to. It'll be. Look at her hair. It's crazy. Are you ready for some serious pampering? Sure, Katara. Whatever you say. As long as they don't touch my feet. Oh, man. Oh. Getting all no, that earth no. off. Oh. <laughs> you can't do that. That'd be nice. <laughs> That's sick. 
my gosh. <laughs> wow, great makeup. Thanks. For a clown. Oh, Ooh. roasted. Roasted. Get him back, Toph. You guys don't know about the war. You guys are the clowns. Yeah. Put a sweater on your pet poodle monkey. <laughs> Come on. She's going to send them off that bridge into the water. Let's go, Stomp on that ground. Am I crazy or does the animation look different? I just feel like the way that the characters look is just a little bit different. Oh. Now that was funny. Maybe, yeah. Oh. I'm not looking for anyone's approval. I know who I am. Hell yeah, That's tough. What I really admire about you, Tom. Don't listen to the haters. You're really pretty. <laughs> I am? Yeah, you are. Nice. Katara is always super nice. Except when she's actually making fun of Toph for being blind. That was not cool. What is We're moving quick. Oh, the Tales of Bossing Say. Yeah, that's the episode name. This is the Tale of Iroh, though. Guess we're gonna look at tea. The Moonflower likes partial shade. My man tried taking over this place back in the day. Yep, yep. <laughs> war crimes. Committed war crimes. From the vine, so slow. <laughs> Brave <soldier> boy. Ew. <laughs> He's a little snap, Bob. <laughs> 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 Iroh's the coolest, bro. And the mom? He's the coolest. Oh. That's not how you play. To admit mistakes when they occur. And to seek to restore honor. But we're leaving. When I'm through with you, kids, <laughs> the window won't be the only thing that's broken. But not this time. Run! <laughs> Give me all your money. Oh. <laughs> Good stance. What are you doing? I'm mugging you. With that stance? What? What are you talking about? His one foot is actually pointed backwards. <laughs> That's how I draw people when I was a kid. Your feet. Oh shit. Iroh's got hands. With a solid stance. Don't teach him how to <laughs> rob people. <laughs> You do not look like the criminal type. I know. I'm... I'm just confused. So you're trying to mug people? I'm just confused. <laughs> Goodness, sir. Of course. This is so great. T fixes everything. Happy birthday, my son. Ah. Uh. R.I.P. Bro, Luten, is that his name? I think so. Oh, Iroh. That Iroh seems like one of my favorite in the show. I just love it. I love that song. Hey there, fella. You look hungry. <laughs> Oh. What kind of animal is that? Ooh, that's a rabaru. I wish I could get her a big open Rabbit kangaroo? A rabaru. There's a big open space right outside the walls of the city. But how are you going to transport all these wild critters? Don't worry. I'm great with animals. Mm. Oh. Oh boy. Bro. Not his finest idea. No, my cabbages. <laughs> what are the snake birds? Oh, shit.
Uh oh. Creating a stampede. Ah. <laughs> uh. Open that thing. That guy needs to move. Open up the pit. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at him earthbend, bro. He's nice with it. Oh, oh. yeah. Created a little paradise for them. Well, maybe not paradise, but it's pretty cool. You should think about working with animals for a living. Mommy, the snowflake got out of the house again. Damn. Lucky kids? What are you doing down there? <laughs> you should probably stick to saving people. <laughs> okay. What could he possibly be doing here? Probably gonna get a lady. He's a ladies man. What's this? Through all the <laughs> winter. What's this? Glow. <laughs> oh. Why does he always find like an all girls thing? I just wound up here. Sokka's just drawn to all the women. <laughs> five, seven, then five. Syllables mark a haiku. Remarkable oath. I am not an oath. There we go. Haiku on the on the spot. You think you're so smart with your fancy little words? This is not so hard. Ooh. Damn. Whole seasons are spent mastering the form, the style. <laughs> None calls it easy. I calls it easy. Like I paddle my canoe, I'll paddle yours too. Oh, <laughs> burn. Oh my gosh, he started slapping his ass. This is like the final scene in 8 Mile. Right back at you, like my boomerang. Oh, drop the mic. I don't Damn. know. Can you come back from that? He brought out the boomerang. Oh. That's right, I'm Sokka. It's pronounced with an Akka. Young ladies, I rocked ya. Oh, that one didn't hit. That was six syllables at the end, not five. Uh, that's one too many syllables there, bub. Oh, and he's out. After all that, fumbled it. <laughs> that was Saka's story. Don't look now, but there is a girl over there at the corner table. She knows we're Fire Nation. Didn't I say don't look? <laughs> Seems to me she has quite a little crush on you. What's your name? My name's Lee. My uncle and I just moved here. Hi, Lee. My name's Jen. Zuko cannot handle getting flirted with. Wondering if you would like to go out sometime. Come on, Zuka. Great. I'll meet you in front of the shop at sundown. Come on, Zuka, give it a shot. Oh, oh my god. What was he thinking with that? Hey, well, look at you. You look so cute. Oh, let's fix that. <laughs> what do you like to do for fun? Nothing. Oh god. Would you and your girlfriend care for just Zuko's a great date? My oh, okay. <laughs> Why were you traveling so much? We were, uh, part of this traveling circus. Really? What Absolutely you pulling shit out of his ass right now. You juggle. Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> no. Can Zuko juggle? No. Don't <laughs> do no, can't. Uh -oh. I can light them for you. The fire's not lit. Don't peek. Close your eyes, really, dude. Bro, don't do it. Okay. Now you can look. 
Dude, what? Like, what are you thinking? Yeah, not a good, not a good thought. What happened? What did you? I caught it. I just fucking snapped my fingers and all the lights turned on. Wasn't any fire bending. I brought you something. Oh, Zuko. For a free cup of tea. Lee, this is so sweet. We give him a kiss. I have something for you too. Now it's your turn to close your eyes. Uh oh. Oh, Zuko. Oh, Zuko. Oh, whoa. What's wrong? It's complicated. I have to go. Oh. Ah. Oh. I like them together. Zuko's such a shy guy. <laughs> Iroh is out the window looking for him. How was your night, Prince Zuko? Terrible! I hated it! Why did he get so mad? Oh, it was good. You had a good time. Momo. Our favorite. Here we go. Lots, lots is Where gonna, is lot is gonna get done in this one. Momo's dreaming. Yeah, Momo and Appa. That's a cloud. Bro, I read online, I don't know if this is true, but apparently there's a, there's a person that voice acts for Momo and Appa. Like, it's the same person making their noises. That's cool. Let me know if that's true or not. I don't know. What are Panthers? <laughs> yeah. My god. Imagine just walking down the alley of a city and you just see that. Can't Momo just fly away from them? Yeah. Oh, go higher. Damn. They're everywhere. No shot that, like, they just don't mess with people. <laughs> <laughs> the Momo music gets me every time. Surely they want to go for the other monkey. No, they only want Momo. One's attached to him. Oh, how strong are you? Oh no. Momo, you have gotten yourself into a situation here. I was gonna say, dude. <laughs> Come on, let them go too. We out. Are we friends now? The alliance <laughs> has been made. <laughs> oh, they can maybe track the scent. Oh yeah. That's a big old footprint. Mm-hmm. Oh, Momo misses his friend, dude. Show me Appa. Uh-oh. Four weeks. It's been a while since he got captured. Put this down. Oh, that's so embarrassing. What? <laughs> she said that, talk trash, and then missed. Oh. <laughs> So messed up, dude. Leave Appa alone. They just drag him through the desert. I do not like these Sam people. I'm sorry, Appa. It wasn't your fault, Toph. You literally can't see. <laughs> it's a rocket. <laughs> oh, that's the one they found, I think, in the sand. I feel so bad for Appa. I know, dude. It hurts seeing him like this. I bet someone will pay a fortune for him in Ba Sing Se. 
All right, you've got a deal. Abba! Oh, he heard it. He's trying to fly. <laughs> Got him. Fast acting. God damn. Yeah, I mean, for a big fella. No! Oh. So close. You had no choice but to behave outrageously, like a wild animal. You won't anymore, because I am going to break you. Chill, bro. This is a circus? Hungry? Don't worry, I'm going to feed you too. But not yet. Oh. <laughs> Up as an airbender. Can't keep that food from him. Of course, when you perform, the hoops will be <laughs> flaming. You're about to be sorry. Oh my god, dude. Fucking relax. In the abuser bottom. Oh, dad seems nice. <laughs> dad seems cool. Thank you, young child. That's how Appa sounds. I need more time with him. It's too risky right now. Too risky? What are you talking about? This is the circus, home of fear and... Dude, don't make him try to do a thing right now. He will just destroy the place. <laughs> I hate that guy. He's the worst. Anyone who treats Appa like this. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> now for some what an asshole. An absolute prick. It's a sky bison. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he just knocked his ass out. Ah. No. Oh, Appa, yes. Freedom. Oh. Is he crying? Get out of there, big guy. Oh, he went back to the tower. Oh, I like him so much. He's such a good guy. Oh. Uh. No, not the bees. <laughs> Dude is covered in honey right now. Dreaming of home. The good old days. Look at the old baby sky bison. <laughs> oh. I guess this means we'll always be together. <laughs> oh. Not them having the same dream. Oh, it's some kind of monster! Appa is looking pretty terrifying right now. 
Do not show that man fire, bro. Oh, the servants pass. <laughs> I didn't see anything. Oh my God, that's a big boar. You're just fending for his life at all times. What's in him? I guess like branches and stuff. I don't really know. Oh my god, Appa. Beat his ass. <laughs> Just get a good night's sleep, bro. Get out of there. He's getting turned into a savage. It has not been good for Appa these past four weeks. He's got some rest, though. Now, finally. After... He has oh the Kyoshi Warriors. Hey yo. <gasps> Appa? Oh no. No. He's been lost for a while and he looks like he's hurt. He's shy around people and scared. Stay low and stay quiet. Suki found Appa. You're hurt. We can help you feel better. And we can help you find Aang. Did you say Aang? Aww. <laughs> nice. That's the op I know. Oh, Azola? Yep. What? Oh, no. No. Kyoshi Warriors and Appa versus the Bad Girl 3? <laughs> Any friend of the Avatar is an enemy of mine. <sighs> Dude, Tylee is such a cheat code. <laughs> You're not prettier than we are. Fire. Mmm, Azula is cold. Get out of here. You have to find Aang. We'll be okay. Oof. This is a rough matchup. Props to Suki for, for giving it the old try. But Azula is in another tier of strength. Water Nation. Oh. Old home. An air temple. <laughs> Who's this guy? <laughs> Guru Patek. You've been through so much recently. Hurt and betrayed. So twisted up inside. You got that right. I've been expecting you in the young avatar for quite a long time. I had a vision many years ago of helping him. Mm. <laughs> Someone looks very well dressed. Judging by your bed, <laughs> <laughs> I have prepared a message for Anne. May I attach it to your horn? Gotta take that to Aang, Appa. By reading your energy, I can sense where Aang is. I'll see you again, great beast. Papa went to bossing say. Didn't we see his footprint in the ground already though? He did. Uh -oh. We did. 
I just want him to be reconnected. No, it's a fake long thing. Bro. <sighs> yeah, that was really sad seeing Appa's lost days, like it was called, like ever since he got captured, he was just beaten up tortured abused by all these different people just passed on to other people uh for profit i hate seeing it he literally became unrecognizable at one point we've never really seen him get aggressive like that towards like just random people uh and it's, it's interesting he did see people like he saw suki uh uncle iroh saw him so people have been seeing him that haven't been in our group uh and now he's just in bossing bossing say underground it looked like at least for a little bit right there um but yeah that that guy that was from a few episodes ago that was really uh strict and weird but um i don't know i just i really need him and ang to be rekindled because they need each other they're connected spiritually they have a great bond they've been with each other forever and it's just so sad seeing both them on their own. They're just so lost without each other. And I feel like a reunion's coming and it's gonna be very, very good. Yeah, I'm honestly a little bit scared for Suki too. Like she was just fighting as well. I don't know if she wins that fight. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen to them. Maybe they get captured. But the first episode consisted of a lot of stories. There's a lot of good ones. Obviously, Momo misses Appa as much as we do and much as everyone else. I just, Appa and Aang, they need to be rekindled, man. I just, I can't, it's just so sad seeing Appa with sad, like all this, I don't, I just need him to be back with Aang because he's breaking my heart over here yeah the first episode like you said was like a bunch of different stories of all of our different characters and what they were doing in bossing say and they were all pretty silly for the most part but the one that i think stands out is iroh's obviously uh he was like visiting uh, a tree and like setting up the picture of his son singing the song super emotional moment but uh, I also wanted to talk about it because it says, like, in honor of Mako uh, at the end of that scene. And Mako is actually the voice actor for Iroh. And he actually uh, passed away, like, shortly after that. Oh, so wow. it might have been his last or one of his last performances. But uh, I know that he is not the voice actor for Iroh throughout the whole show. So they did that, like, little little moment for Mako as well as for Iroh's son in the show. So that's why I like that that so much. It just hits a little bit harder when you know the, the real life story. All right, guys, that is it though for these episodes. If you guys have been enjoying these reactions, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Check out our links in the description. We got our Patreon, our Discord, our second channel, Atalk. All of our social media is in the address to our PO box. But yeah, we'll catch you guys next time for book two, episode 17 and 18 of Avatar The Last Airbender. Peace out.